Today we're going to be talking about comparing and ordering fractions, decimals, and percents. Just as a review before we get started, when comparing, we follow basically the three steps. Number one, turn all numbers into one form, whether they're all decimals, all fractions, or all percents. Uh, two, compare the rewritten numbers to determine which is bigger, which is smaller, when you have them in that one form. And then three, when you're placing an order, make sure you use the original number. So our first practice, which is greater, 25% or seven over 25? I personally like to deal with decimal numbers. So I would first, I would change 25% into a decimal. You can divide it by 100, or if you remember, if the decimal points here with a percent, just move it two places to the left. So as a decimal, it's 0.25. Next, if we want to change 7 25ths in the decimal, we would do a division problem. You would take 7 and divide it by 25. All right. So you add your decimal. That would go in there twice. That gives me 50. I get a remainder of 20 at a 0. 25 can go into uh, 200 eight times. And that comes out evenly. So the decimal form of 7 over 25 is 0 0.28. Now, as I look at the decimal numbers, this number is bigger because it goes from 0.2 to 8. This is 0.2 to 5. So my greater number is 7 25ths. Another example, example number 2, which is greater, a decimal of point, 0 0.49 or 49 hundredths or 94%. There again, change them to be the same form. You could change them both to be decimals or both to be percents. If it's if it's a percent, if, let's say this one's a percent, I want to change this one to a percent. I would multiply that 